Welcome back to Joe's Astrology and in these next couple slides I'm going to talk about the astrology of Nike and I'm going to show you how the astrology reflects a lot of the qualities that Nike has and some of the things that Nike wanted to do with their business. Now I want to look at two charts of Nike. This is going to be the second chart. This is their May 30th 1971 inception when the name actually changed to Nike and what I first want to point out which is not on here is that Uranus is here it's in Libra where it uh, esoterically rules and the asteroid Nike is at 14 degrees conjunct Uranus that's the asteroid Nike. Now it's not on here. Uh, and the reason why I want to point that out is looking at this chart and looking at the other chart, their first um, first chart when they were when they started as Blue Ribbon, their son was in Aquarius. And this is a very Aquarian Uranian company uh, with that Nike asteroid conjunct Uranus. And here we see the north node is in Aquarius, and it's conjunct Mars. And it's making a trine, a trine out to that Nike asteroid and Uranus in Libra. And in this chart, we also have a trine to the sun in Gemini. So a lot of air, uh, with Nike being a, starting off as a running running shoe company, uh, sports company, air is a perfect uh, perfect fit ruled by Mercury and we can even see here if we look at Mercury it's at 17 degrees Taurus and it's making a trine, I'm sorry, a square to that north node in Aquarius and of course Mercury is exalted in Aquarius as well. And here going back to their first chart when they were known as Blue Ribbon we can see the similarities. Here the stellium, the Sun, Mars, Saturn in Aquarius, Mars and Saturn uh, being notorious for athletics and sports as indicators in the birth chart. And here we have the conjunction with the Sun in Aquarius, as I was talking about Aquarius, where Mercury is exalted. Again, we see Mercury here at 10 degrees. Oh, here it's in Capricorn, but it's at 10 degrees and it's conjunct the south node in the other chart, the Nike chart. It was squaring. The nodes here it is conjunct the south node and it's also making a trine to that Uranus down there at nine degrees almost exactly so again we have more Aquarius we have more Mercury and Uranus also is making an inconjunct to uh, that Mars that Mars stellium in Aquarius and there's indicating, uh, and it's interesting, it's indicating there an adjustment, which it seems Nike has made when they changed their name uh, to Nike in 1971. We also see that more, more air with this Gemini moon, more uh, trine energy, easy flowing energy with that trine back out to that stellium. So here we are back at the Nike chart in 1971 and the sign Aquarius, some of the ways that you can really see uh, Aquarius in the Nike company, of course obviously you have Michael Jordan who's coming, um, who's coming into the scene later on, he was a son in Aquarius, uh, but their motto is uh, one of their mottos is everyone is an athlete and that's definitely a Uranian and Aquarian type motto where they're where they're including 
all people in their company that you know obviously not everyone is an athlete uh but everyone has the capability of being an athlete of learning to be an athlete and that's very community oriented and inclusive of all people it's very aquarian another famous slogan of nike uh is probably more famous just do it clearly with that mars north node in this chart and the mars mars conjunct the sun in the other chart that heavy mars influence makes perfect sense with the slogan just do it 